It is time for the highs and lows of the week, and our first high goes to the pizza delivery guy who deserves a big tip and maybe a badge for going above and beyond the job. Tyler Morrell was at a customer's door in Brookhaven, Pennsylvania, when he saw police engaged in a high-speed chase out on the street. Suddenly, the suspect jumps from the stolen car and runs right toward Tyler, who squares him up and sticks out a leg to trip the perp. Guy falls to the ground and is quickly apprehended by the cops. And let us not lose sight of the fact that Tyler managed to hold on to the pizza and what looks like a salad or maybe some garlic knots up top there, delivering them safely to the front door. He starts running. I'm like, like I got the pizza in my hand. I didn't get the cash yet for the pizza, so I'm like, I'm not gonna go back without the money for this pie. So. I just like did what I honestly feel like I did what anybody else would do. Got to get that cash. Tyler's assist was caught on a doorbell camera and posted online by the Brookhaven Police Department, which joked they have a job waiting for Tyler if he wants it. And he still made a clean delivery. Amazing work. Our first low goes to the tense stare down between a black bear and a homeowner in Asheville, North Carolina. David Oppenheimer was unwinding on his patio after a long day when a big fella wandered over and caught him by surprise. David's security camera captured the sheer look of terror on his face as he is startled in full recline there by the furry visitor mere inches away, he even clutches that pillow in a death grip. Luckily, the bear is spooked too and quickly scurries off. David said he was already acquainted with the animal who had rummaged through the trash and eaten from his bird feeder earlier that day. They're old pals, but things do look a little different when you're face to face. Our next tie goes to a budding t-ball star from New Jersey named Matea, who legged out an infield single in a game this week with extra points for style. Go, mommy, go! Again. Fantastic. The six-year-old star of the Kenilworth Rockhounds makes contact, flips off her helmet like you do, and then cartwheels right past the gaggle of infielders who swarm to the ball, leaving her a path to first base. Matea's parents said she could not even do a cartwheel a few months ago, but she loves gymnastics so much she's been practicing nonstop and breaking them out wherever she's going, including to first base. Never stop cartwheeling, Matea. Our final low goes to the latest in our running series of failed gender reveal stunts. Parents in Virginia wanted to include their four-year-old daughter in their big reveal, which is sweet. They handed her a pair of scissors to pop a balloon where the pink or blue news would be announced in confetti. But it appears the instructions were unclear. All right, go up there. No. No, Billy! Oh, my God. I mean, you handed her a pair of scissors. Sweet Finley there was told to pop the confetti-filled balloon, but instead of popping it, she snipped the balloon string and sent it soaring into space. The failed reveal quickly went viral with more than 30 million views. The family did try again by blowing colored glitter out of her mom's hand, but mom and dad are keeping the gender a secret for now. Finley making a quiet, brave protest against those elaborate gender reveals. We stand with you, Finley. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.